Hello, this is Sigma to Talking. Please subscribe. Uh, today, um, following on from that other tutorial, I, did, I want to show you if you have, say, a where do you go? Oh, PS2 controller, or possibly an Xbox 360. I don't know. All I know is Xbox 2 bleh, PS2 controller. I can show you how. Let me just move this out of the way. How to connect this onto your laptop, computer, PC, whatever, I don't know about Mac. Um, so all you need, what you need is a, obviously the computer, PC, whatever, and uh, a PS2 controller, and a sort of, it's, this is, oh sorry, I thought, I'm looking for my eyes rather than this, a PS2 to Xbox 360 converter, if you can see. Um, yeah, mum got it for me, she didn't even know what she got for me really. As you can see, it's hooked this the PS2 control is hooked up to here. Ugh, it's just doing it one handed here, guys. Yeah, see, it's basically the hook up like on a PS. Yeah, I'm not bothered to do that. So, God. let me just put this back. I don't know if you can see this. Um, yeah. I don't exactly know what this is, I percent you know, but uh, you know, and uh, PSG hooked up and hooked up to the laptop by USB, if you can see there, hey, uh, see, and what this basically does is enables you to use your PS2 controller as a gamepad on your uh, thing, on your laptop, uh, look, I'll show you, I'm going on Games Explorer, and why is it so dark on here? Uh, if I go tools, input devices, as you can see, the control of Xbox 360 for Windows comes up. That's what it recognizes this thing as. And you know, you can basically, if you double click here, you can see the properties that like the settings and to see. I'm pressing. You can't even see. No, you can't. I can't show you that then. But basically, I'm going to the analog. See if you can see that little X thing there. And I'm just spinning. Yeah, and you got all the X, circle, tri triangle, square, start, so there. You get what I'm saying, anyway. You can eat. Okay, on this, but just to make sure, if you do have this particular one, Make sure it's on joypad and not on dancing mat. I got confused once when I had done it on there and then I thought I completely mucked up the calibration forever. As you can see, well you can't see but I am moving the analog stick and it's not moving. But if I put it back to joypad, I'm moving the analog stick and now the joypad's moving. Yes. Okay, I'll for, to show you how this thing guys is actually working, I will go on. Only specific games can actually uh, accept the. Uh, I don't know if it's accept the correct term, but you know, use the controller as a controller. I know two of these games I have this Halo Combat Evolved and Doctor Who Adventure games works as such, but I'm gonna go on Halo Combat Evolved because it's much more quicker loading time think about it, especially with my laptop being kind of slow, which I hate about it. Right, you have to say, if you do decide to get this particular game, it is quite complicated to control, you have to sort them out yourself on the gamepad, look, rather than going up and down like that, because I decided this up and down, like, right, up, down, and obviously I, it stopped, start is select. Continue. How am I meant to show you this? I thought I chose continue. Oh god, I have to show start again. Oh well, I don't care. I don't know if you can see. Look, see, I'm changing the navigate the way it looks, and I can also. Okay, maybe not. Okay, maybe...